I know that it is haram to eat food on which puja has been performed. In India, during the festival of Ayodhya Puja, rituals are performed on public transportations, equipments in hospitals, labs, gyms and colleges. What is the ruling on usage of such equipments and machineries on which puja has been performed? Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala says in the glorious Quran in Surah Al-Baqarah chapter number 2 verse number 173 in Surah Al-Maida chapter number 5 verse number 3 in Surah Al-An'am chapter number 6 verse number 145 as well as in Surah Al-Nahl chapter number 16 verse number 115 حُرِّمَتْ عَلَيْكُمُ الْمَيْتَةُ وَدَّمُ وَلَحْمُ الْخِنْزِيرِ Forbidden for you food are dead meat, blood, flesh of swine and any food on which any other name besides Allah's name has been taken. So if there is a particular kind of food or certain sweets or a particular dish on which the name other than the name of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has been taken so we are prohibited from eating such food for example if some person he has cooked some food and he has taken the name other than the name of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala or he has performed some rituals on this food taking the name of some idol so in this situation we cannot eat this food and we know this based on the verses of, verses of the glorious Quran but as far as using equipments on which puja has been done, whether it be machinery, whether it be public transportations, whether it be gym equipments, whether it be vehicles, etc. Can we use such equipments? These equipments can be used because the puja has been done by other people and the prohibition in the glorious Quran is for us to eat the food on which the name other than the name of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has been taken but usage of such equipment there is no problem in it and we find this that it is very common in India that puja is done on various equipments and for example if you are staying in a house a rental house that is for example owned by a Hindu and the Hindu does puja on this house do you mean to say that you will leave the house because puja has been done? In India, people do puja and religious rituals on an entire building. So do you mean to say that you will not stay in the entire building? But natural, no. The prohibition is for us to eat food on which other names besides the name of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala has been mentioned. But we cannot do these religious rituals. We cannot take part in these religious rituals. And at the same time, when this puja is being done on public transportations on vehicles we cannot be a part of it this is totally haram this is totally prohibited but if someone has done puja on certain equipments then there is no problem in using such equipments but at the same time we should see to it that we do not involve in these religious rituals in these religious activities for example puja or the other religious rituals that are done we should not be a part of these religious rituals. So I hope that answers your question.